we've implemented a new set of technologies to create a seamless modular experience. Most importantly, we've put modularity where it counts. Let's take a look. This is the developer's edition of ARA. We've integrated the phone technology in the frame that frees up space for modules that will create and integrate new functionality that you cannot get on your smartphone today. It has six modular slots. They're built for flexibility. You can put any module anywhere. All slots are generic and support any functionality. Each slot supports up to 11.6 gigabits per second while consuming one third of the USB 3 power. They're, they are interconnected via a UniPro network. That allows you, for example, to route raw 4K video directly to a, a computer vision coprocessor for real-time processing. It's ready for the most advanced high-performance applications. Modules are designed to work with a variety of form factors. Future frames can be larger, they can be smaller, or something completely different than a smartphone. Current modules will work with future frames. Future modules will work with current frames, protecting the investment of both users and developers in modules. All right, so how do you add functionality to your ARA? Step one, plug in a module. Step two, use it. <laughs> OK, guys, smile. There you go. It's that simple, it's that easy. Uh, no rebooting your device, no hunting for drivers. And um, how do you reboot a module? Well, you select the module you want to release from the settings up. Just tap it. And then when I turn it so it doesn't fall, it's just going to pop. Oh, I may have gone too fast on that. Let me try that again. Let's try a different way. OK, Google. Eject the camera. There you go. <laughs>